Hey, welcome to the Soil Inventory Talk Show. My name is Bliss Rero, a farmer and an agronomist. I'm so glad that you had time and chance to be here with me today. Um, I'm doing a recap of my 2022, the achievements and the, the, the projects that I started and things that I hope um, to complete maybe in 2023 and to great partnerships that I've had within the year. So um, one of those is that was pending was um, furthering my studies, which I thought I would have completed by this year, 2022, but seems didn't happen. I hope to complete all the pending projects, including the studies in 2023. So 2022 has been a beautiful year, one that um, more passionate about farming most definitely, and I did explore beyond the crops because uh, when I started farming, I was so passionate about the crops and I was um, a crop farmer, if there's anything like that. And um, being an agronomist, that means I've specialized more on crop production, but I did explore chicken and uh, new projects that I'll be giving snippets of in this video that I did explore. So the year has been beautiful with beautiful partnerships. I did partner with uh, beautiful and amazing people, agronomists, uh, beautiful companies, NGOs that are there for the farmer. Um, I did lots of training with them. Uh, Perfid is most definitely one of them. I did a video with them here uh, on this channel. And uh, it was beautiful to go and just um, interact with farmers, see them adopting new technologies, and seeing farmers that are still willing to stay in their cause. Uh, farming not being an easy task, and at times might be frustrating, especially when the seasons are not, um, are not as they used to be, and also when the market um, fluctuates a lot, it discourages one to continue uh, staying on the course, especially if you're a small-scale farmer. But one of the lessons that I'm taking with me is that um, in farming business, you do not stagnate, but you keep expanding and learning and also setting uh, the, the goal that you, you need to be um, to achieve. But also when you are checking the farming uh, industry, you need to learn it and also understand what uh, your, your final goal is. Are you there for the local? Are you there for expansion? Are you there for the export? What crop are you doing? And what type of business do you want to conduct? I will also be showing uh, a snippet of how the year has been uh, going to the market, getting groceries, and these groceries, um, putting them at the soil inventory grocery store. I'll be using bananas. Uh, I think that's what I documented most. And um, having that uh i'll showcase how one goes to get bananas from the maybe from the wholesalers or from the farmers uh having them not ready putting them till they are ready and um, yeah still it gets to the final consumer so the market was not easy it's definitely one of those things that um i think uh at the farming business the end of it we take um we take advantage of or rather we we underestimate how difficult it is to to market the farm produce or rather for the farm produce to get to the market and to earn a decent income so the year has been beautiful year and uh enjoy this video as i highlight um one of my most my most memorable moments my best moments the growth the expansion and looking forward to 2023 with bigger and greater projects and completion of the projects that we started. And one of the projects that I did start, or rather we started at the end of the of 2022 was the dairy. I'll be showing where we are at right now. Um, I'm grateful for the project that I did. That's the chicken. I'm grateful for the tree planting exercises that we started and um, being handled by uh, the soil inventory in partnership with so many other agronomists in partnership with uh, um, with organizations that were ready to uh, to partner with me or rather with the soil inventory in um, 
conservation agriculture, in um, practicing agroforestry, and uh, also just having uh, to inspire the next generation, which we purposely did by having students or pupils on board. So enjoy this video and um, have a beautiful one in 2023. This is how a uh, banana room is prepared when the bananas have been picked from the farm and they are not yet ready and now they are placed here so that they can um, speed up the, the rate of um, the bananas being ripe. So yeah, this is how the room is prepared for the bananas from the field with the nylons in the papers. After that, the bananas are placed inside. Um, these were bananas that had been placed there for a couple of days. We were checking if any was ready. You can see over there, I had spotted one of the bunches that were ready and then we cut them. And uh, these ones will be ready in a few, but the ones that have been uh, covered with banana leaves are fresh from the field. This was one of my memorable days also. It was raining at the field when we were harvesting uh, maize. Is not easy. That's the maize it's field hard. that we had. And it's very raining and we had to look for shelter in the field. It's very frosting over there. So farming ain't easy, man. <laughs> but uh, it's all worth it. Yeah. What do you say? What do you say? Wakulima na umia, anteseka, inia masaibu ya wakulima. And to our final project of the year, this is the dairy unit that we have been working on. So far so good, we are almost there, we are almost done. And then we'll bring the animals, but this is the project that we have been working on towards the end of the year. So this is the dairy unit. I will be documenting more on it and also the journey as it has been uh, step by step and also what we have learned in the process. And to business deals that were done over pizza, <laughs> that's carrying fashion and our kind of series over there to beautiful businesses. That I had for today, till next time, remember to stay blessed and productive. But before I go uh, to beautiful, um, partnership that I did this year. So one of those is these uh, positive vibes by Karine Fashion. You can check them out across their all social media platforms. But um, it's been a beautiful one. Cheers to 2023. Bye.